there's motivation and inspiration to use technology with our students. Our students are very well versed in technology and we just wanted to try it with technology as opposed to just using hand to paper. So imagine if you're a student coming in for orientation day and you have no idea where you're going. The goal is for this particular activity to give you some sense of where are the student services specifically. Things like the Wabnode, maybe the athletic center, the learning center. And so the goal then is for a student to load onto their phone really quickly. Thanks to the help of people that we had collaborating with us from the hub, the technology of HP Reveal. There were posters placed throughout the college, so they would hover their phone over the poster and the poster would reveal the clue to the next location they were to go to. When they found the last image, the last image was that of myself as well as my colleague. And at that point in time, they returned back to our classroom and uh, we kind of tallied the results to see who actually made it around the college without getting lost. Our program is designed and developed to support people who experience life with developmental disabilities and dual diagnosis. So some of our students were wearing goggles, and some of them were wearing um, headphones, noise cancelling headphones. So we really wanted the students to have the opportunity to support someone who may experience a number of different challenges as they were walking through the campus. One of the things that we do in the Community and Justice Services program is we always have second year students as mentors so that they can make a connection between people. And so they were stationed around the college so that they could use as a resource. And the students that were second year actually commented on how exciting this process was. Because when they did it, it was old school technology. It was just paper and they ran around and read the clue and then went to the next location and read the clue. It's been a fantastic experience for the students and it was a fantastic experience for me to collaborate with my colleagues in the hub and with Cynthia, of course. So all around, it was a wonderful experience. I'm doing it again in September and I think it's just going to grow in its capacity. And right now, this is our initial one. So Cynthia and I are going to get together and work out some of the the little quirks and tweak a couple of things, but I absolutely enjoyed being involved in the process and I think it was definitely beneficial for students and it did help build that teamwork.